Good day everyone, Complaining Gamer here. If you've not been keeping up to date with the rapid development of Switch emulation, where have you been? You've already missed so much. Right now we find ourselves in game in Super Mario Odyssey with a high degree of accuracy depending on the kingdom you're in. 3D graphics are rendered and textures loaded correctly on a variety of objects and characters. Much work is still to be done, but the fact that we are in this position already is actually staggering, especially considering just weeks ago in-game equated to an empty black screen. Now we can load a save and play around in any kingdom of our choice, however you'd need to be pretty hardcore to fight through the current FPS. Leading the pack we have Yuzu in what is set to be a very exciting emulation race toward perfection. A race where we, the community, benefit from the incredible skill of the teams involved. If you lack the technical knowledge to support the project, you can help in another way. If you have a dollar laying around, then why not throw it at the Yuzu team as it helps the developers focus more of their time to perhaps turn a passion project into something more full time. You'll find the Yuzu Patreon page linked below. Now that you know where we are with Super Mario Odyssey, what's more exciting is to know the direction it is heading and what the future planned developments are regarding improvements. I went straight to the source for this one by asking lead Yuzu developer Bunny, quote, For the time being, Super Mario Odyssey is a personal priority of mine. Other team members are focusing on multiple titles. For absolute clarity, our focus is on accuracy first when it comes to implementation of any element. Due to the complexity of Super Mario Odyssey, progression in that title should benefit many others. Big changes in the pipeline are caching shaders, caching shader uniform data, basically constant data fed by the game into shaders, caching vertex data uploads. Once we have these things in place, I expect to see anything from 2 times speed improvements and potentially more in game. Perhaps not full speed at that point, but much more than the current FPS. As far as accuracy improvements, there are indeed lots of bugs, but better texture emulation is the next priority as well as improved shader accuracy. If you've been keeping up to date, we've already experienced up to a 50% boost in FPS because of improvements made to shaders. As well as the advances we've seen in a very short period of time, you may be happy to learn that the latest speed boost along with Super Mario Odyssey changes can all be experienced in the latest Canary build of Yuzu available for free right now. Not only that, you can now start a brand new game without the need for a save file which will successfully get you through the introduction into gameplay. At the current pace of progress, I know that I personally can't wait to see what's next. Remember, if you want to support Yuzu, you can do so over on their Patreon. Leave your ideas, thoughts and comments down below. Complaining Gamer social media links are also there. If you dislike the content, dislike. If you liked it, leave a like. And to stay up to date with all things emulation, subscribe and hit that bell icon. I'll catch you in the next one.